Extraordinary Dogs is brought to you by You Can Uber, where we believe all dogs are extraordinary. Catherine is one of the judges for this year's competition. Masher, Deneen Fox's Papillon, is one of the most spectacular Papillons in agility today in this country. He is amazing. But like any other dog, he sometimes just becomes a dog, and in my ring today, he decided to take the Grand Tour. He missed her signals, and he just kind of did his own thing. But then I've watched him in other courses this weekend, and he has just been spot on. It's round two, and this time the pressure is on. Two rounds are over, and the dogs get to rest for a while. It's the second day, and the tension is building. Just the same as yesterday, all the competitors need to do today is beat the clock. But it's not that easy. The course is tricky, but you just have to be there and work it. You have to keep the dog's head so they know to turn with you. Their strong hindquarters and balance account for their sheer speed and allows them to traverse these courses with ease. The reason behind this? Dogs have evolved a superb natural agility. Agility, uh, I guess, is something that doesn't have a specific scientific definition, but dogs are incredibly agile. Uh, little dogs look more agile than, than larger dogs, but I think that's, that's just the human eye's perception of their agility. I think dogs have uh, incredible ability to balance and to control their gait during fast motions. But I think the, the really impressive thing with dogs is the, the you know, broad uh, diversity that we see from uh, in different breeds, so from very small dogs that are, have obviously been selected for maybe terriers, subterranean combat, through to greyhounds, which are you know, incredible athletes and extremely fast. It's the last round, and this is the chance for Masha to shine. was unstoppable in his last round and did so well he beat his personal best. Unfortunately, it wasn't enough to get him through to the end. We didn't have a great weekend, but to go and really do well in the last round, it's okay, because it's all confidence building and know to come out and do well another day. Danine and Masha failed to qualify for the finals. Well, we started out very confident and sometimes it doesn't always go as planned, so you know, stuff happens. And you just try to make the best of it, have a good attitude, run your dog to the best of your ability, and have fun. He's crazy. He loves the game. He loves playing the game with me. He absolutely lives for this. Loves it. 